Today for Mousetrap Monday, we're gonna do a competition of mice, rats, and squirrels versus flex paste. Now I've never even heard of flex paste until a YouTube viewer sent me a link to a video for one of those as seen on TV infomercial products. It's for a strong, flexible, rubberized paste that can do all kinds of things, including making a bow out of chicken wire and blocking a hole in a barrel filled with water that was cut with a chainsaw. And it also claims it can block rodent holes to keep mice and rats out. So we're gonna test it out and see if that's true. We'll go ahead and remove the lid. Inside's a preservation packet and a layer of foil. Don't throw that away. We're gonna save it for the unused flex paste. We'll place it back on there. As you peel it off, it's sticky like a black tar. Here's the bait box we'll be using for our test. There's holes in front and a wire screen on top. We can take that off for now. Over the past several weeks, I've completely filled this with sunflower seeds and both squirrels and rats are very comfortable going inside and getting the free food. I blocked this one off with a screen and this one we're gonna plug with the flex paste. We'll go ahead and take a good amount. It's a pretty wide gap to fill. I'm gonna have to back it with some paper. So it's been two full days. It's slightly flexible in the middle. On the outside, it's very hard. It looks like it's gonna work, but we're gonna go set up the motion cameras in the barn. I'll fill the box with sunflower seeds. They might be able to chew through it. I just don't know. Let's see what happens. Well, here's the results after several weeks of leaving our bait station filled with sunflower seeds out in the barn. Both mice, rats, and squirrels all tried to get inside. But as you can see, the sunflower seeds are safe. None were successful. They chewed on the wire on top. They chewed the wood out of this hole, but with the screen there, they couldn't get in. And they chewed in the flex paste. You can see teeth marks, but even though they scraped it away, it was just one layer, it kept them out. So overall, when it comes to blocking rodent holes, I'm really impressed with the flex paste. Even though it's an as seen on TV infomercial product, it actually worked. I have over 600 videos on YouTube and currently I'm posting new videos every Monday and Friday. So if you wanna see the best videos on how to deal with mice, rats, squirrels, chipmunks, moles, voles, and gophers, stay tuned.